Hello and welcome back to Mega Reacts. Today we're going to be reacting to Person of Interest Season 1 Episode 9. Last episode might be one of my favorite episodes of Season 1. Definitely probably top 2. Maybe top 3. I don't know. I'd have to go back and really go through them all at this point. But we had the Count going head to head with a with an old German spy who... <laughs> Was in a hole for about 25 years and showed back up in New York for revenge only to find out his wife, who was the point of him being on this revenge to get the men who, who killed his wife, turned out the wife isn't dead and she wanted away from him also. Proving that she made the right choice, he decided to kill her and he found out they had a daughter and instead of letting her think her father was a hero he had to just show up and prove how wrong she was so <laughs> it was really a interesting episode a lot of good interactions the person of interest that they were after that episode was really interesting we also got a little flashback into when the count first became i guess more of a questionable spy type character killing people getting rid of bodies uh, basically doing the exact same things that the person of interest in episode 8 was kind of doing. So, really interesting there. Cannot wait to see where this goes. Please come on this journey with me. To do that, all you have to do is like, comment, share, subscribe. Patreon link in the description below. This is Mega. Let's get into it. 2004. Nice, getting more backstory. It's all yours. Or I thought. I thought that was going to be the count. Hello, Yusuf. Oh, nice twist. I remember she was in the war. Close enough already. She goes today. But it's got to be clean. Thanks. Oh. Don't bail him out. He's obviously an abusive. I work homicide, Mrs. Kovac. Okay, I'm the one who has to investigate it when your husband finally beats you to death. No half measures. I chose a half measure. When I should have gone all the way. If he puts his hands on you again, call me. Can't help people who can't help themselves. It's a sad reality. And I know somebody saw something. Yeah, getting my talk is another matter. I'm yeah. sure you'll charm something out of them. <laughs> that person who talked just got gunned down. You know, even after we working, taking it back. Line. My friends call me Lionel. You got a first name? Sure. Detective. <laughs> I Why like her. Why not the Fusco with the NYPD? If anyone has seen or heard anything pertaining to what happened here tonight, you can call me at... Uh -oh. I your card, Lionel. Whose number came up? Mutual friend of ours. Mm. Detective Carter. Oh, no. It's got to tie back into her time in Iraq or... Afghanistan. I've narrowed the list of possible suspects to a little over 300 or so. <laughs> and the life of a homicide detective. On a more yeah, immediate threat? that is a lot. Hector Alvarez, indicted for homicide on a case she worked six months ago until the charges were dropped. Edward Kovac, repeat felon, spouse abuser, whose wife she's taken a keen interest in protecting. And then there's Elias, ruthless killer, organized crime boss, who's already taken a shot at her. Man, what is she a... I don't like the looks of this. Yo, thanks for making it look good, detective. Think I tweaked my wrist. That was a little too deep. Well, it's a snitch. Hey, wait a minute, Reese. I think she knows him. Ever seen you? It's all for show. Sure. Must be one of her CIs. Good looking out, BC. 
If you get anything back on um, Hector or Elias, there's more where that came from. Mm. Hector, look into it. Elias gonna get you killed, son. Not to be trifled with. Hey, Captain. Welcome back, Detective. Detective Carter doesn't understand the rules. She's bad for business. I said partner, though. Sniffing around, trying to build a case. He's gunning for Elias. She's got to go. It's a tricky business getting rid of a cop. Went through the proper back channels. Up the chain of command. Permission granted. Oh. Just got to look... Clean. Clean. So it is a corrupt cop. You like in the line of duty? The corrupt, the corrupt bureaucracy so within the police. Keep my distance if I were you. Wow. I heard some kid got popped last night. You got any kids, detective? Oh, oh, oh. that's not Stay subtle. Off this block. I see this car roll by one more time. I'm gonna impound this. I'll be seeing you around, Mr. Castillo. Would you go home and put your hands on your wife again? I'm coming after you. <laughs> you come after me, and I will exercise my Second Amendment rights. I promise you. I got a pretty big gun. Man is angry and bitter as you are. I got a feeling it ain't that big, Eddie. Oh! Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. I knew there was going to be a, got a joke. Sure like her style. I like her style, too. I think we got it. Castillo said he came into his market a couple times to purchase some booze and Trojans. So? His girlfriend lives in the Bronx, too. Why would he have to go 25 blocks downtown for condoms? He has another oh, girl. A little cheeky on the side. Mm-hmm. And that'll get his always... Place. His always to alibi to back him up. She's gonna find out find this chief he has a woman on the side. I'm gonna make some phone calls. Mm -hmm. If anything happens to her, Lionel, I'm coming for you next. <laughs> oh, oh, is he about to go and just dominate this chop chop? Oh, <laughs> that's so good. Rubber, rubber bullets. Knock, knock. Tell Hector I'm the guy that just put him out of business. <laughs> You're still in this car. I see him again. I'll close down more than the shop. Probably shot the dude in the chest. Maybe not. Maybe it was the shoulder. Me and Hector was together all night. We watched TV, and then we went to bed. What'd you watch? I don't know. Hector's always changing the channels. I heard that about that guy. He gets bored. He likes to switch it up, huh? <laughs> uh. Is that why he has that other girl on the side? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. You see, my man don't step out on me. I'll cut it off. Ooh, okay. Come here. Mm -hmm. I want you to see something. Oh, no, 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 no. That's Hector's cell phone bill. Hello? Who is this? Wait, who the hell are you? <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, all right. Here we well, go. It looks like you two got a lot to sort out. Uh, make sure they don't kill each other. <laughs> Hello? It's got a gun. Oh, wait a minute. Calm down. I can't understand. It's got a gun. Get out of there. Oh, that's it's the. Hurry. Just a bastard Where husband. In the bathroom. Say where you are. I'm gonna come and get you. Hello? Hello? Carter's going to the mm. Kovacs house. He's armed. Sounds extremely agitated. Reese? Where's Reese? Where are you? Show what you went for backup. I got a bad thing. <sighs> Hope she's not Put dead. Put down your weapon. I can see this. Jerk going murder suicide. What the hell? Oh, nice. The count got there first. Somebody's been doing that a lot lately. Mrs. Kovac? Be okay, Mrs. Kovac. Mrs. Kovac. Right. 
be willing to talk now. Are you okay? Please. Are you okay? <laughs> yes. That man hasn't shown up. That man. What'd he look like? Hello? It's for you. <laughs> One day they will meet and become great allies, I assume. Those flowers. You people can't arrest me. Yes, we can. Your wife is pressing charges, Eddie. Yes, finally. We get a warrant on Hector Alvarez yet? Yeah, ESU standing by. Who died? Oh, who died? ongoing thing maybe with her well, look why don't you take whatever is, I got did she so set him up let's this. just call this a down payment okay I want you to have that I'm sorry Cardi <laughs> you always been good to me but I ain't got no choice oh he's gonna do it you told me to find that guy a liar but I found him holy smokes sorry I know she's got a vest on, though. Said it's either gonna be you or me. It ain't gonna be me. Wow, this caught me off guard. Off guard. I know this doesn't change anything. I know you'll still arrest me if you get the chance. But you should know, whether you like me or not, Joss, you're not alone. I did not see her informant being the trigger man. I mean, I figured he'd probably get killed, but I guess he was given the choice. Elias got to Carter's CI, turned him into his trigger man. Is she safe? For now. Time to end this finch, once and for all. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Elias can't kill a cop without permission. Run us up the chain of command. Permission's been revoked. Tell Elias if he so much as touches Detective Carter again. I will put him, you, everyone on the ground. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I believe him. I know you believe him too. She, she recognizes that motorcycle sound. Another fantastic episode. Be right back with you. So that was episode 9 of Person of Interest. Good episode. Found out the detective was an interrogator in the Army. We knew she was in the Army. We knew some of her backstory. But this episode, we really got to learn a bit more about that. Saw, you know, kind of the kind of interrogator she was. Not really a torturer like we saw in the previous episode. But would actually connect with the person and saw them as equals and as humans and through that through her compassion was able to get things and you saw when she found out that her word was broken that you know she was ready she was ready to kill that guy and i don't really blame her and you can kind of see why she might have gotten out of the military and why she likes being a cop being kind of on the front lines of helping people so i like that aspect of it got to see the the corruption in the police force which was pretty intense got to see how much respect the count has for the detective and what she does and who she is and and i believe if something happened to her he would burn it all down which is fantastic but either way Great episode. Cannot wait to get further into the series. See where it takes me. Come on this journey with me. Before you do that, like, comment, share, subscribe. Patreon link in the description below. This is Mega signing off.